Yo, what's up, guys? It's Aptrix here. In today's video, I'll be showing you guys how to spoof your location in Pokemon Go on any iOS device without using a PC. Alright, guys, for today's video, we'll be using the brand new version of i2Lab AnyGo, which is available officially on their website, which will be given in description box below. This is an amazing location spoofing tool created for games like Pokemon Go to protect your privacy and spoof location for entertainment and educational purposes. It is available for iOS devices as well as Windows, Mac, and Android. You guys will be able to see some of its features such as teleportation mode, joystick controls, cooldown timer and lot more. To start spoofing our location, we'll just go and tap on this button and make sure to add the i2lab anygo on our iOS device. Afterwards, tap on this button. This video has been sponsored by i2lab but I'll be giving you guys my honest opinions on anygo. And now you guys will be able to see anygo has been successfully added on our iOS device. Let's start setting it up. First of all, you'll need to open settings. Afterwards, go to general, scroll down until you find VPN and device management. Management. Once that has been done, make sure to select the Anygo app and tap on this button. Afterwards, tap on allow and restart. Afterwards, swipe up and tap on this button. Once that has been completed, simply launch Anygo on your iOS device and wait for a few seconds until the loading is completed. Here we go. Now we should be all set to start using this tool. But before we do that, tap on me and make sure to activate your Anygo using your email address and registration code. Once you have successfully activated your product, it will say registration successful. Now what you gotta do is simply tap on this button. After Afterwards, make sure to tap on upgrade to official version. Afterwards, make sure to add the Anygo official version on your iOS device. Now that it has been added, let's tap on the open button. Afterwards, you'll need to register this product once again. But once all of those steps have been completed, now you'll be able to use all the features of i2lab Anygo and spoof your location in Pokemon Go. The first thing which I want to show you guys is the teleportation mode. If you tap on teleport to any location, it will ask you to complete this setup. You'll need to configure VPN, so simply tap on this button and tap on allow and wait until it has been successfully executed and here we go guys after completing all the setup you will get a prompt saying change location successful so we'll just go ahead and tap on the ok button and open pokemon go on our ios device so here we go we'll just go ahead and tap on ok and as you guys can see we are able to spoof our location without needing to use a pc let me show you guys how easy it is actually to spoof your location in pokemon go using i2lab anygo so inside the app you will be able to teleport to any location instantaneously in just a single click so here let's say I want to teleport to this location, I'll simply pinpoint the location after a tap on teleport. Now we'll tap on the OK button and as you guys will be able to see we have been successfully teleported to the location that we selected. Not just that but i2lab anygo also offers you lot more features such as the joystick control as well as two point and multi point movements. Let me show you guys the joystick control first. So simply tap on the joystick afterwards select the speed at which you want your character to travel at. Afterwards you'll get this joystick where you can select the position or the movement of your character and then tap on the play button. You'll be able to see immediately our character has started walking and if we go back to Pokemon Go you guys will be able to see the location is being spoofed in real time and it is working properly without any issues. If you want to stop the joystick control you can simply press the pause button and exit it. You can also use the search bar at the top to teleport to any location or any country you would like to visit. We'll just go ahead and search for Dubai United Arab Emirates. I'll just go ahead and select it after a tap on the teleport button. Once that has been done if we go back in Pokemon Go you guys will be able to see we have been successfully teleported to a brand new country in just a single click. Let me show you guys some of the other features of i2lab anygo. For example, the two point movement. I'll just go ahead and select two point and here i2lab anygo will automatically create a route which your character will follow to reach the destination. Now here at the top you'll also be able to tick mark speed is variable if you want variable speed. At the bottom you'll also be able to see ETA or estimated time of arrival along with that the distance of your route. If we open Pokemon Go and go back you guys will be able to see our character is walking without any issues. Similar to the two point movement you also get another feature known as multi point movement where you will be able to set multiple points in this entire map and create a route which your character should follow. So this is going to be your own route which you will create. So we'll simply tap the start button afterwards. Similar to the two point movement your character will walk to the first point afterwards the second point third point and so on. So all of the features in i2lab anygo work properly without any issues. You will also be able to check out historical records to see all the locations that you have traveled to previously. You can bookmark your location as well and you can even scan for pokemons by tapping on the pokemon icon as you'll be able to see these are all the pokemons that are available near my location. So yeah guys what are you waiting for make sure to check out i2lab anygo right away and try it out for yourself on your ios devices.
this. That's going to be it for today's video though. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.